Thank you. Thank you, Chairman. Thank you, President. Thank you very much for this honor. And boys and girls and parents, congratulations for the great uh, achievement of your schools. And um, the good news is from today, you don't have to worry about the endless papers and tests. But the bad news is from today, we are going to have a new test. But still, a lot of people told me when I graduate that life is much tougher after you graduate from university. Things are not that true. Life is much better outside the campus. So enjoy it. And I, I never in my life that have dreamed that today that I can wear this beautiful robe. Ab absolutely, this kind of robe is not designed for, for body size like me. So with great respect, can I put my hat here and be myself? Sometimes to take honor is more heavier, much more heavier than take the criticism. Life is like a box of chocolate. You never know what you can get. This is the movie that I love most, The Forest Gums. I failed three times in entrance examinations, and I tried many times for enter good schools, always fail. My parents said, you will never have a chance to get a bachelor degree. My friends believed that you and I will never be successful. And but today I got a doctor degree. <laughs> when you believe in yourself, you have the chance. When I started my business, I told myself that if Jack Ma can be successful, 80% of the young people in China can be successful. Nobody in my life said, you are smart. Today, many people say, Jack, how smart you are. You can find the internet. You build up the e-commerce. I said, it's not me. It's my team. It's the dreams we believe together that reach, that make us till today. So what I want to tell you today on the way here, and I say what I should share with you guys here, because it's too early for me to share with you my life experience. I'm still young. And, uh, but I think one thing for sure that is very difficult to convince a successful people. It's always easy to convince those people who want to be successful. This is one of the reasons why, this is one of the reasons why Alibaba survived, that we try to convince young people to be more successful, help them to be successful. So some of the Advices I want to give you here today is number one, persistence. Always persistence to be yourself. Always persistent to your dreams. And never ever say give up. Never ever say no. I think all the parents try to tell us what is right, what is wrong. And my father always say he's better than I am. My grandfather say he's better than my father, but we proved we do better. And I'm sure you will do much better than we do. And one thing also for sure, that always persist on the first dream you had. 14 years ago, when I started my business in my apartment, I told my wife, in the future, at that time, I, all the savings I have we have only 5,000 US dollars. So I asked my wife, do you want your husband to be the richest person in China, or you want to be your husband to be a respected business leader? And she said, be a business, uh, respected business leader. This is what I want my husband to be. So since then, I know I don't want to be a rich person in China. I don't want to be a rich person in my city. I don't want to be a rich person in my village. I just want to be a person that can be respected. And also, one thing for sure, if you want to be respected, you have to suffer a lot. And in Chinese, I say, everybody has to suffer. And the second thing I want to give advice to all the students here is always be optimistic. 
And always to be happy, always to know tomorrow is better. Most of young people today complain that we don't have opportunities. Jack Ma, Pony Ma, all the people take all the opportunities. We complain too. In my time, I complain Bill Gates. You made a Microsoft that do, do not have any chance for me. When other people complain, that is your opportunity. The world is always better. Human beings have survived after thousands of thousands and hundreds of disasters. And yesterday is always the easiest day. My philosophy in the past, past 14 years, that one thing, today is tough. Tomorrow is much more tougher. But day of tomorrow is beautiful. Most people die tomorrow evening. You will never be able to see the sunshine of the day of tomorrow unless you work really hard. And today also people complain that Hong Kong has no opportunities. And I think Hong Kong has opportunity. And I think today China has opportunity. A lot of people would love to live, lie on the yesterday's success, but I love to live in tomorrow's dreams. Yesterday, Hong Kong has a good family business, real estate business. And yesterday, Hong Kong has European and UK working style. Today, you have a new business style, you have the new China. So listen and try your best. And the third, which is very important to me, and I believe it will be very important to all of you young people here, embrace the change. The world will never change unless you change yourself. The world is changing so fast. The value that in our company, which is loyal, is, which is very, very unique, is embrace the change. We change every minute, every time. Because when you change, it is painful. If you don't change, it is very bitter. You never know that life changes so fast. So I believe one thing. Life is not about how much you achieved. Life is about how much you experienced. A lot of books about us. A lot of stories about us. I'm sorry I did not read all of them because when I read the stories about me, about us, I feel shame. I'm, we are not that good as people thought. We are not that bad as people think. We are just ourselves. The book I want to write one day is Alibaba 1001 Mistakes. Don't learn from the great success stories from the others. Learn from the mistakes the people make because most of the people make the same mistakes. Not all of them have the same success. And life is about adventure. Young people, just to go China. Go to China. China is changing. Go to the world, world is changing. And always make sure that because of you, the other people changed. And the best way to avoid failure, the best way to avoid failure in my life is to change when you are at the best peak. My companies experience that. Always destroy your good model, good time, when the time is the right. Which we say, fix the roof when the sunshine is still there. Do not fix the roof when it rains. So my best wish to all of you, these are the three advice I give you, the persistence that is optimistic and embrace the change. And I wish all of you 20, 30 years later, we're standing here, wear this beautiful robe, and that will meet your size, not me. Thank you very much. Thank you.